Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Adonis Albright. The Supreme Court ruled in favor of the Biden administration today, allowing it to end remain in Mexico. The Trump era immigration policy lets migrants make asylum claims, but forces them to wait in Mexico for their court hearing. President Biden tried to end the controversial policy previously, but a lower court blocked that attempt. Immigrant advocates say the policy is inhumane because it puts migrants in dangerous conditions and infringes on their right to seek asylum. But once that policy is officially ended, what will happen to migrants who are currently in Mexico waiting for their hearing? In reports of uh, hundreds of um, assaults, rapes, kidnappings, and tortures uh, for those who are forced to remain in Mexico, which in many cases is just as dangerous as the other country that they're fleeing from. Under 10,000 migrants were enrolled in that policy since January. On the other hand, Title 42 is still in place at the border. It deports nearly 100,000 migrants a month, and they're not allowed to make an asylum claim.